GOTC is getting out the caucus and it's important because it's really sort of grabbing people out of the woodwork. And for our campaign, you know, we're really focusing on those who are undecided. So January is going to be our time to really spread the message. But I've now visited 62 counties. Well, thank you so much. And I hope I never let you down, man. I'm giving, me, I'm giving this campaign all I've got. You know, we are the fun campaign. We are the young campaign. So I think uh, for caucus goers who you know, it's exciting every four years, of course, for the presidential elections. And this year is the first, you know, new one for a lot of people who haven't gotten involved since 2008. And I think what we can do is really uh, tap into that energy from 2008 and, uh, and hopefully, you know, bring some excitement back to the caucuses. Oh, 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 And it is out of our party that new leaders emerge. We need to build upon the legacy of President Obama, not by going back, but by going forward. The next chapter is going to be a great chapter for America. We are on the threshold of a new era of American opportunity and greatness. The period of GOTC is usually the four days before um, leading up to the caucuses, and that's when we're going to be making tons of phone calls. We're going to be calling the people we've been talking to for the past six months, and we're actually going to be calling new people as well, because you never know that person that's going to be inspired to leave their house and go caucus for Martin O'Reilly. 